In this video, we take a look at some of the best shortwave radios available in 2022. These radios can be used for a variety of purposes, from listening to news and weather updates to tuning into talk shows and other high-quality programming. So whether you're looking for an excellent shortwave radio for travel or just want to hear more about your favorite topic, these radios are sure to satisfy. We have included links in the description box. Let's get started. At number 1 is Texan P Lead 180. The Texan P Lead 180 is an improvement on its wildly successful predecessor, the PL660. This device has a fantastic ergonomic design and excellent reception. It is well known among seasoned teasers. In AEM there are four, and in SSB there are three broadband filtering arrays. It runs at a frequency of 2.3 kHz and barely affects the sound quality. The Texan P Lead 180 shortwave radio features a sizable backlit screen. If you don't need the backlight, you can turn it off. Numerous details are shown on the screen, including the band name, battery life, time, and frequency. The P Lead 180 is an excellent choice for AE and reception because of its excellent sensitivity to faint signals. Background hisses and digital noises are eliminated. The radio's SSB reception is another asset. The included an antenna can improve SSB reception. With FM reception, the radio broadcasts at its best. The P Lead 180 shortwave radio can clearly distinguish between stations that are quite near to one another in addition to picking up far off FM broadcast. The telescopic antenna proved to be quite sensitive and potent. I discovered the hard way that tuning to local stations while extending the whip antenna merely causes them to be overridden. Don't do that, then. The radio's fine tuning knobs make SSB tuning incredibly simple. For those who adore SSB, the 10HE tuning step makes it a better choice. Don't be fooled by its modest size when it comes to the sound quality. For its tiny size, it is very loud and clear. The radio has a 3050 station memory capacity. What else? The 40mm 3 watt speaker has a 4 ohm impedance and produces crisp sound. The speaker isn't particularly loud but it's adequate for any home environment or a quiet location. By connecting it to the headphone socket, you can forego using the speaker and instead use a set of earphones or headphones. A 3-volt Li-Ion rechargeable battery powers it. It's a good thing the radio comes with a battery. At number 2 is Eden Elite 750. The most durable, high-end shortwave radio is the Eden Elite 750. You'll be surprised by the variety of features that make up for the premium price point. Here are the answers to your fundamental queries. Its tough construction gives the impression that it could survive a nuclear explosion or a global zombie apocalypse. Two easy carry handles on either side of the Elite 750, along with an additional carry handle on top, make portability something you can never complain about. The M, FM, shortwave, and airplane band may all be easily handled with the Eden Grundig Elite 750 radio. Longwave might ask, it is present. The range for longwave is 117 to 137 megahertz, whereas the range for shortwave is 1711 to 30,000 kHz. The Elite 750 radio can receive single sideband, which is something ham operators want, and is obviously meant for intermediate and professional users. With the Eden Grundig Satellite 750 Ultimate Shortwave Radio, you may enjoy AEM talk shows, FM music channels, news stations, and more. Obviously, you can't carry this around in your pocket, but it makes a great desk accessory. The dual antenna of the radio is its most remarkable feature. In addition to the standard shortwave antenna, there's also a longwave and mediumwave AEM antenna that rotates 360 degrees and can both receive and amplify signals. The AEM band can be switched in 10 kHz steps. Did I mention that it has a 1000 channel memory, of which 500 can be customized? The remaining 500 are split between the Aviation, MFM, SW, and LW bands. You can transmit radio signals to another radio using the line-out connection that is included with the Elite 750 radio. External antennas can also be added for the FM and AEM connectors. Very little drifting occurs after tuning to a station thanks to the excellent tuning of the Elite 750 radio. The large speaker and amplifier are housed in a separate chamber, which is what gives the radio its girth. The Satellite 750 Ultimate benefits from a high sound quality because to the separate compartment's ample area for reverb. With customizable treble and bass, 
The Elite 750 has a clear, sharp sound. I did, however, see that bass control affects the loudness level. You may use the dual alarm clock on the radio to set alarms for two different times. This shortwave radio has a sizable LCD screen with backlighting. You can turn the light down to prevent it from disturbing your sleep. The screen is fairly big, so the clock, frequency, and alarm time all have clear readings. At number 3 is Texan PL360. It's time to concentrate on this tiny guy's qualities and talents if you've had enough of laughing at its design. A digital signal processor is included in the Texan PL360 portable shortwave radio, which enhances listening experience with high tone quality and superb clarity. The portable Texan PL360 shortwave radio can lessen static, given the radio's tiny form factor. That is a bit unexpected. The Texan Easy Tuning Mode, a proprietary feature, is included with this static reduction and simplifies tuning. A high-sensitivity AEM antenna that can be detached is included with this ultra-portable radio. For FM reception, it also has an external shortwave antenna. AM, FM, and SW can all be received by the radio. The radio has 450 channels it can remember. For shortwave channels, 250 memories can be saved, and for AEM and medium wave channels, 100 memories apiece. The radio also contains an alarm clock, a sleep timer, and a snooze button. Additionally, it contains a 5-volt mini USB-DC input connection that you may use to replenish the internal rechargeable battery. The radio can be powered by 3 AA batteries. Thanks to its digital signal processing technology, this shortwave radio can produce sounds that are clear and sharp. If you're asking whether or not you can use headphones with this shortwave radio, the answer is that you can. In fact, the maker includes a pair of stereo earphones with the product. The maker also included a lovely carrying pouch. Given that the radio is portable and lightweight and can travel with the owner, it is a thoughtful addition. A carrying pouch also serves as a protective layer. At number 4 is Kaido Kai 500 shortwave radio. Although this item should have been higher on the list, I pushed it down because I am not writing about emergency radios. It is, however, unquestionably among the best shortwave radio receivers you can purchase with your hard-earned cash. It has a solar panel, a hand crank, and an internal rechargeable battery. You can recharge it with the hand crank. Additionally, there's the option of charging the battery with a USB or AC adapter. Even with the internal batteries removed, the radio can still be powered by the 180-degree swiveling solar panel. The device can alternatively be powered by three AA batteries. It's fascinating that the radio already has seven NOAA channels pre-programmed that will notify you of weather conditions as they change. The radio can operate on shortwave, AM, and FM frequencies to enhance the reception. You can extend the telescopic antenna. A reading lamp, an emergency beacon light, and a flashlight are all included with the radio. Your phone or other smaller gadgets that support USB charging may be recharged using the internal battery, which doubles as a power bank. For private listening, you can utilize the 3.5M headphone jack on the device with headphones or earphones. The sound is crystal clear, and the speaker quality is adequate. If you turn up the level all the way, there will be some issues with audio quality. The radio has a carry handle that makes it simple to move around. Despite not being a pocket radio, it is a fantastic survival tool. At number 5 is Panasonic R562DD. The Panasonic R526DD is one of the best shortwave radios on the market right now. It has a bit of the traditional and a touch of the vintage. This radio covers AM, FM, and SW frequencies and features a stunning retro appearance that would look great on any contemporary desk. You shouldn't have too high of expectations for this transistor radio. Radio reception is the only function it performs. I'm done now. MP3 support is there, but there are no buttons, memory, alarm, or clock. You get a headphone jack, but with this vintage radio, you'll probably want to throw that piece of technology out the window as well. It boasts a sizable speaker that generates powerful music without distortion. All tuning must be done manually using the tuning dial. Although hard, this is enjoyable. It is designed for those leisurely summer afternoons when you believe that unwinding and rejuvenating yourself only requires a vacation from the modern digital life. I apologize if I didn't live up to your expectations, but I assure you that it is a true classic that will bring you treasured doses of nostalgia. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this video, and please like it if you did. If you're new here, click the subscribe button.
wishing you all the best until the next video.